Welcome back to Virtual Framer. This video will explain the various parts of the Settings tab, your Virtual Framer's default settings, and what they are used for. Click on the Settings tab. The default directories group is where you assign the directories, where you have your art, frame molding and mad images stored. If you have a central network storage for images, you can assign them here. The art directory is where you store images of your art. The molding directory is where you store your images of your frame moldings. The mat directory is where you store your images of your mats. The drag and drop feature will only work with the default directories that you set. The visualized directory is where you can save your frame designs, so you can email them to your clients. The staging directory is where all temporary files are stored. You might want to clear the contents of this directory on a regular basis. You also want this to be a local drive. The default sizes group is where you set your most commonly used art width, top mat width, and bottom mat reveal size. In this group, you can also set if you want a drop shadow to your frame designs. The wall colors group is where you can select and set your most commonly used wall colors. The supplier websites group is where you put your supplier's website URL. Enter a two digit code for each supplier. The code you enter will be used as labels for buttons in the Capture tab. The supplier's URL will be used in the Capture tab when you want to take molding frame and mat images from your supplier's website. Do not forget to click on the Save button to save your changes. Thank you for watching.